hey guys how are you all doing so in today's video i'm going to be showing you what i'm doing to pretty much all of my wigs um if you know me you know that i don't really like laying wigs i don't really like laying wigs with glue so what i do now to make my wigs lay flat without glue is to add elastic bands to my wigs okay i'm going to show you all of that in today's video but the star of today's video is this wig from ali grace hair so this is a um 24 inch body wave hair and it is 180 density uh let me show you guys the wig okay wait this is um the bag let me show you what comes inside the bag um so you just have this wig cap and yeah a card from them i already have a black wig cap on but yeah let me show you the wig okay so this is the wig it is body wave so yeah i've worked with this brand before their hair is really good this is body wave this is body wave okay it's really full this is 180 density it's really full and it's really soft okay just look at this it's really really soft and really beautiful i was actually planning to curl this hair today but i don't think i'm going to do that because i absolutely like just look at this isn't this beautiful so yes it comes with a 13 by 4 frontal as you guys can see but yeah like i said i'm not going to be laying the frontal per se i'm going to be adding an elastic band so that it stays snug on my head but let me just put the wig on my head first so that you guys can see what it looks like um well, let me get my mirror here uh, i'm not ready yet like i'm still wearing my morning robe okay but after this i'm going to get ready as when i'm done styling the hair i'm going to get ready and wear this okay so yeah this is what it looks like it's already laying you know kind of flat but i'm still going to add an elastic band so that you guys would you know see how that looks i'm also going to be plucking it because the hairline is pretty thick so i'm going to be plucking it um should i make this side pattern or well, should just leave it like this I think I'm going to leave it like this though. So I use this one inch elastic band. You can get this at any, you know, sewing supply stores or some of these craft stores. It's one inch elastic band. You can do 1.5 inches. You can do two inches, but this is one inch and it works really well. So I'm just going to put it across my head and measure, you know, where it stops, right? Okay. So we're going to start from somewhere here, which is just a little bit over a little bit above my ear i'm not putting it close to my ear like this i'm putting it here so there's still space between my ear and where the band is so, so that it doesn't give me a headache uh and then i'm just going to try and measure where it stops yeah it's somewhere here so this is actually tight but not too tight for me okay i'm not um drawing the elastic band to the limit i'm just putting it where it feels comfortable but it's also snug okay so yeah it's pretty much somewhere here um i don't know if you guys can see this band so this is um where i'm going to be cutting and sewing to my lace so i'm just going to go ahead now and cut it um yeah so i'm going to be sewing this to the lace front and i'm just going to work on the wig a bit so that you know it can look better okay so i'm just going to be sewing this from here so this is where my it stops above my ear so this is slightly above my ear right and then i'll take it to the other side and sew it here as well slightly above my ears right so can you guys see this I actually turned the wig to the back so that i can see properly where i'm supposed to sew the um, elastic band right let me quickly show you guys what i do to my elastic band to prevent it from fraying like this you guys can see this yeah so this happens to elastic bands a lot if you're not careful it will just keep fraying you know on your hair so um i just take it i take my lighter okay and i just burn this end right it prevents it from fraying you know further i learned this you know when i used to sew just you know burn the ends a bit yeah so yeah this is it now it is not going to fray anymore like it's not going to fray so let me just go ahead now and sew it to where i need it to be
guys so i'm done with my makeup part of my eyebrows looking crazy i got them microbladed so i haven't touched it okay um yeah so i am done plucking um the hairline i've also gone ahead to color it with my foundation and this is what it looks like now so yeah that's the band let me put it on my head now and see what it looks like so i'm just pulling the um elastic band down okay and then this yeah this is really really snug yeah this is really really snug i feel like the hairline could use a little more plucking but i'm not going to touch it anymore because i might be giving my sister this wig and i don't want i want her to be able to pluck it to her own satisfaction but i think it looks pretty good like this let me go ahead now and cut off the lace all right guys so this is it this is the lace on my head uh, i don't know why i feel like putting a pattern on this i just feel like putting pattern on it like somewhere here uh maybe i should have put pattern on it actually I wish I had put a little bit of part in there, but I'm just going to leave it like this. Um, yeah, so that's the hair. Um, I want to brush it well. You guys, look at you guys can see how snug this hair is. Like I'm literally pulling it. You can see it's moving, but it's not coming off, right? For it to come off, I need to like hold it. Like, if I'm not spoil this hair, but yeah, I need to hold it very well for it to come off. Yeah, so it is just being held down by the elastic. Um, I want to brush the hair well. The hair is so bouncy. I use, let me move back very well. Oh, well, I've been brushing on top of this my microphone. <laughs> anyway, the hair is so, so bouncy. Whoa, this is gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous hair. Um, yeah, so like I said, it's from Ali Gray's hair. All the links to this hair and all the information about this hair are going to be in the description box, okay? Um, it's 180 density, it's 24 inches, and it is body wave um yeah so you can glue it down if you want but personally i really don't have time to be gluing down hair especially these days that you know it's festive period so much to do so little time to get ready wow just look at this just just look at the waves on this hair just look at it that means this hair will actually take curls really well because mind you i have brushed this hair several times like when i mean several times i mean several several times because i was you know, each time I try to pluck, I'll try to brush out the hair to, you know, see how it looked. So I have brushed this hair several times and it still looks like this. Wow. Next time I wear this hair, I'm going to wear it in the center part. But for this video, I wanted you guys to see how, you know, the front looks without any um, glue or product to like lay baby hair and all of that. This is just the elastic band holding this really flat on my head. Can you guys see this are you looking at this you know so um i absolutely love it um this part okay this extra part you, you can either cut it in if you cut it in like this you won't need to you know you won't you won't have this extra part you can also just glue hair down if you don't put glue all around but the reason why i didn't cut it off is again i'm giving the hair out so i want her to be able to you know lay the whole front if she wants to lay it or however she wants to lay it okay so yeah that's it the link to get this hair are going to be in the description box and all the details about it okay this is absolutely gorgeous hair like you guys can see this i love how bouncy it is like it's really bouncy it's really smooth um yeah so thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you all in my next video bye guys Mwah.